This is what I'm talking about. Knock this guy out on the way there. Oh, come on. The Arena War DLC adventures continue. Now today we're going to be having some fun with this vehicle that you see behind me. However, first we've got to do something very important because I'm not really feeling the outfit right now. I mean, the outfit we've got on right now kind of looks like poop. Now we are currently on the way to the store, which is only down here. Now this is one thing that I forgot to do in my Arena War spending spree video. By the way, if you have not seen that video yet, that will be linked down below in the description. Or you can click the card that just popped up right now. But yeah, the one thing that I forgot to check out in that spending spree are the new Arena War outfits. Now they've got space creature suits, retro space suits, they've got everything. And I want it all. So I just had to switch my outfit up real quick because I changed the look of my player a little bit. Because apparently in the thing where you change it, I was looking more like a woman than a man. And I didn't actually realise. But man, let's take a look at these suits. These are all the bodysuits. Oh, now this is what I really wanted. The green alien Martian bodysuit. Let's grab that real quick. How much is that? $358,000 for a single suit. Are you crazy? You already know we're still gonna get it though. The purple one, yes, I want that too. Blue reptile bodysuit, that is looking fancy. I want that as well. I'll take that one too. This one looked really cool. I really did like this one. Let's purchase that real quick. Oh wow, I've not seen the pink one, but this one looks even more dope. Let's grab that too. Oh my god, as I go on, the outfits just keep getting better and better. I'm gonna grab that one, of course. The colour schemes are so goddamn nice. Give me that one. Okay, on to the next. Oh my god, man, we're gonna have to buy all of these. Green and yellow one. Okay, I want that. I definitely want that. That one's pretty plain. I'm gonna skip that one. I want that one. That's pretty cool. Anything with colour, I mean, I'm not gonna buy something like that, you know? When you can get an outfit, that looks like that. The purple one looks dope, definitely getting that. Green one looks dope, getting that. I don't know why, but I'm getting Avatar vibes from the blue one. I want that too though. Whoa, look at the eyes on that one. Can you imagine if you woke up in the middle of the night? You know, you're in your bed trying to relax and you turn over only to find this man watching you sleep. Now that would be pretty disturbing. We're gonna grab that one though. So we pretty much got every single one, minus the plain ones. I'm getting Futurama kind of vibes from this outfit. Again, I'm gonna grab the cool looking colored ones. Oh, that one is dope. I want that for show. Can you imagine if your job was like this department on GTA, making the skins? That would be pretty cool. I grabbed the same colours just in this one. These are quite nice. Oh, I'm gonna have to grab the all black one. That one's pretty clean too. The red one's pretty clean. But I think that will be it for the retro space suits. Oh no, these are ugly. Hell no. Space traveller suits. Now these are nice. I'm gonna grab that one. The black one and the white one. And that is it. If someone can calculate how much money we just spent on outfits alone, go ahead and put that in the comments down below. Okay, so now we've got every single outfit we wanted. So I decided I'm going to rock the red and blue Nebula one today. I'll tell you what, you guys just saw every single outfit I bought. Whichever outfit you'd like me to wear in the next GTA 5 video, Comment down below and I guess I'll pick whatever one has the most thumbs up. But yeah, today we are rocking with the red and blue Nebula outfit. And now let's head back to the workshop. And we are back inside. Now what I wanted to bring out and have a play around with today is this vehicle right here. But real quick before we bring it out, I just wanted to double check that we have everything we need. One thing I wanted to do is remove the livery. Don't you think that just makes it look so messy? Look, when we have none, in my opinion, that just makes the vehicle look way cleaner. So we're gonna go with that. I think I wanna add some pony pink lights on here. Yeah, see, I haven't even added all the cool stuff yet. We've got a jump upgrade here, $420,000. There we go, we got that one. Now I went with the scoop simply because it was the most expensive thing you could buy. But I'm kind of feeling this massive fist here. 
Either that or we can electrocute some people. I think I'm gonna go with the fist today though. Oh man, and here we go. Now we've got this vehicle exactly how I like it. And as it's gonna be nighttime soon, when it's dark, then you'll be able to see how the pink lights look. So this fist on the front of the car, I'm assuming does some really bad damage. Right, let's see how effective the fist is at clearing traffic out of the way. Here goes. Oh yes, move out my way, oh my god. So to smaller vehicles, this really does some damage, as you can see. Whoa! God damn it, I flipped the car in the process. Oh yeah, and I also have sticky grenades on this, I believe. Should we test that out? I'm not too sure if they're sticky grenades or just regular... What is this guy doing? Excuse me, sir. Do you not see what vehicle I am in? Right, that's it. We're going to test out the grenades on him. I don't get it. How does the grenade not blow him up? Is it like a light grenade? Well, it flipped his car. Don't flip back over. <laughs> now that he's on foot, let me try and punch him with the big fist. Where you going, boy? <laughs> Man, we need to test out this fist on a player. We've got someone just up this road here. I think he's below, though. Am I wrong? Yep, I am wrong. He's above us right now. I love how he is just chilling there with his sniper out. Hey, buddy. Look behind you. <laughs> oh, damn it. I didn't want to kill him. What the hell? Um, okay. I think there might be a modder online. Yeah, I didn't want to actually kill him. I wanted to get a super big run up and see how far I could punch him. Okay, let's see how good this car is at trolling people. So we've got someone who's inside a shop right now, and we're racing down to him. Hopefully we get there before he comes out. You see, traffic doesn't exist when you have this car. Out of my way. Thank you very much. Right, we didn't make it in time. That guy got out of the shop. However, there is another player here. What is with everyone just coming on GTA and then leaving their keyboard? Oh wait, I think he's back. I totally forgot this car has a jump in it. Oh yeah, that is dope. Right, we're going in for the big knockout. <laughs> but man, if the big fist on the front of the car wasn't a good enough way to get rid of traffic, you've always got the jump. <laughs> Wait, I just realized that it's now nighttime. How comes we can't see the lights? Oh, there we go. Oh, look at that. Oh my God, these lights are so goddamn bright. Oh baby, here goes. <laughs> I'm getting hit by missiles. Oh crap. Oh yes, we've got someone in a car down here. How's it going, man? Don't mind me. I'm just here saying hi. He's like, oh hell no. Okay, well, if you're gonna drive away from me like that, I'm only left with one thing to do, and that is to crush you. So since I now know these grenades don't do anything, there we go. Oh damn it, I killed him by accident. Oh, this guy's trying to kill me. Oh hell no. <gasps> Oh, God damn it. Okay, we're out of here now. Right, if you want to play those games, sir, it's only going to end one way. <laughs> it's pretty cool. This car can take a few hits as well. You know, because if I paid this much for the car to just blow up in like two rockets or one rocket, then I'd like a full refund. Right, guys, so there's someone in a helicopter just up there, as you can see. And he landed to pick his friend up not too long ago. And I rammed him real hard. Oh, here he comes again. Just go a little bit lower. I think my bunny hop can reach him. Can we? No! He's trying to shoot at me now. Oh, there's someone here trying to take me out. No, no, no. Oh, hello. We meet again. How's it going? How's it going? Yeah. You gonna get up? No, you're not. Come on, keep trying to get up, bro. <laughs> Oh, there's a helicopter real close to the ground. Here it goes, come on, let's make it. Oh no, we can't. Damn it, he's only got to come a little bit closer to the ground and he's going to meet the big fist. This is what I'm talking about. Knock this guy out on the way there. Oh, come on. His helicopter's smoking now. I think he's trying to pick his friend up. Oh, he's a really bad driver. <gasps> oh, damn it. I would not do that, my friend. Come on then. Yeah, that's right. Kill yourself. I'm going to wait for his friend to land again with the helicopter. Oh, crap. I tried jumping to avoid the missile. There we go. His friend is landing. Come on, let's make it in time. No. Come on, bro. Why are you being a wuss and flying away? 
Man, I've had a lot of fun today with the Sasquatch. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you're new around here, do consider hitting that subscribe button down below, and I'll catch you guys next time.